Hey everybody, it's Isaac A. Ward L. I'm a social marketing strategist. Today I want to talk to you about a WordPress plugin that I use called Page Links 2. This is a great WordPress plugin in the WordPress directory of plugins, and it does kind of the similar like you could create a custom menu and have it linked somewhere but the thing about page links too is you've got a lot of additional options so for instance on my website I have got a tab called resources now I actually have all of my resources on another website that's a subsite of mine actually it's resources.isaacawardell.com but I want it to appear in the regular menu so I could accomplish that through doing a custom menu and then putting the unique URL in there and everything but I'm actually using the page links too in this case now there's a couple of reasons why you'd want to use this plugin for that sort of a thing alright the first is and here's that resources page and it's telling me right up here that I'm, it's just a redirect it's not actually I don't have any as you can see this is the page here there is nothing on the page but if you were to click it here you can see you would go to uh, a link. So the uh, that's because down here in the bottom I've got this page links to and then I have it pointed to this URL. Something the custom menu cannot do is if you want it to open the link in a new window and sometimes that's the case that I want things to open in a new window so that when they close out they'll come back to my regular site so for instance if I had them going to a external URL that was not one of my URLs I would put this down there so that it opened in a new tab so when they close that tab they could see my site again the other thing that page links to does is you can do this for post so for blog post uh, you can have it actually link to an external resource actually this right here this resource site these are actually all blog entries you wouldn't know it but they're all actually blog entries and yet when you click on them they go to a page on my resources website and that's because I have down here I have the page links to linking to the page from the post. Now this is a legitimate post if we put it in there just something to to get the URL in there you can see that I mean it generates the post right there so that's a couple of the reasons why I use page links too. There's other ways to do it, but they're a whole lot more complicated and they don't have as many nice features. So I just install this little app. If you don't use it, it just sits there and doesn't hurt anything. But if you need to redirect something to an external URL, uh, you can do that or to a one of your other websites or you want it to open in a new tab, this little plugin comes in mighty handy. Hey, if you like this tip, I've got a whole lot more great resources like this and other white papers, reports, templates, tutorials, etc. on the back end of my website at IsaacAWardL.com. All you have to do is head on over there, put in your name and email, and I'll send you a link to where all of those private resources are hosted. I look forward to seeing you over there.